All right, guys, so now what we're going to do is we're going to define a method and we're going to put some type restrictions. So we're going to say define add and then we're going to say a B as arguments and then we're going to end the method and inside of it we're going to say a plus B. OK, now in here we're going to say something like this add two and four and we want to print this to the console log so we're going to say puts okay and we did this before so we're going to say clear we're going to say like this crystal playground is the number six that's fine but what happens if we come here and put in a string of the number four let's come here crystal already is going to give us a problem so it's going to say, hey, man, hey, this method is passing in a number and it's also passing in a string. But you cannot add those two things. Right. So in a situation like this, what we can do straight from the method, we can say, hey, for anybody that's watching this, anybody who's going to use this code. OK, you got to make sure that these are numbers. OK, we do this make sure you put in a space so you can't do this like that because if you do that then that's a, like a named uh, argument and that's not really what you want you want to come here do something like this and you say B space colon and then pass in number okay save that now we're gonna come here press clear okay crystal playground and as you can see it says no overlay matches add with the types of integer and a string so it shows you right here what is actually expecting is expecting a number on a and a number on b okay now if we come here and put in four everything should go and run smoothly run it again and it gives us six okay so we got six there now next thing that we want to do is same thing if we wanted to do something like this and say define print string okay and i wanted to say uh let's say text and then i pass in here a string okay come in here do this put and then I'm passing in uh, let's say text so now when I call this method and I say print string and I say my name is Joe everything should run smoothly it says my name is Joe but if I put in a number here and say 23 is going to give us an error no overload matches print string with type integer okay so it's saying hey text is supposed to be a string so now we get that error ahead of time and we could actually fix it okay so that's how you put type restrictions all right guys so i'm gonna see you guys in the next video bye